Hi everyone, Joshua here for another tutorial and today I'm going to show you how you can make your own customized Spectrum Audio Visualizer. If you don't know what that is, it's on screen right now. And before we get started, don't forget to like and sub for more videos. Comment down below any tutorial ideas for me to do. Cue the intro! Before we get started, there are a few things that you need for this tutorial. First is the background, it could be a photo or a video. Second is the circle photo that goes to the middle, it can be any photo as well. And the most important thing is the music that has to go with the spectrum. That's it, that's the stuff. Let's go ahead and run BSDC and first put the background picture to the scene. Now as you can see, it is not the right size. So let's right click on the image, go to crop tools. Now you can just do auto cropping, but I think for better results, let's go with custom cropping. Go to set the original size, go to the second option, and set the maximum size. What this will do is it will let you select a part of a picture or a video, but in the form of the video's ratio. Now somewhere there is okay to me, just press OK. And now for the circle crop. You can basically do anything you want. Just um, put that in the middle and adjust the size. And you're good. Now you're basically done when you have those two things. You can just add anything to make it look better, effects, overlays, and more. But of course, I'll be teaching you the making of the spectrum. I'm gonna be speeding this part a bit, so if you want to skip, just go ahead. And now for the teaching part. Okay, so. Go to this equalizer symbol, I don't know your layout setup, so just try to find this thing. Click that, click spectrum, and then choose the song you want. Click OK. First it won't show up, but if you go to your preview thing, and you're gonna see your mouse become a cross. And when you click and drag your mouse, the spectrum bars will form. And place it in anywhere you would like. So I wanted to make you guys learn the properties window, but that was way too much work. So you can just go ahead and explore. The only stuff that you need to know is that you need the log of power option and the stored energy so that it's less laggy. Okay. Now for the placement of the spectrum. You just want it to go half of the circle pick because we're gonna put that behind the circle. And as you can see, the bars can be shown, you just need to stretch it. Now as you can see, it is still not visible, so just stretch it out as much, but not too much. And now just duplicate it, to not make it hard, and then just go to the other side, and as you can see, it's not really on the right place. For that, just do a vertical flip. And you're basically done with that, you can make it 4 spectrums, a circle, make it go round, anything. It's your choice from this point on. I did change it myself, just like what I'm showing to you guys. But like I said, you guys can change it, so enjoy the result. That's it for this tutorial guys, make sure to like and sub and comment down below any tutorials you want me to do and maybe share this video to your friends and see you in the next video.